Well, when I saw a desert in Dubai back in 2001, the first time I saw, I fell in love. The whole idea of unknown, dangerous. And when I got back to London, I went online and I did my little search and the Marathon des Sables came. I said, okay, I want to do that. So there wasn't any kind of thinking behind, none of it. I saw it, I want to do it, and 15 years on, I'm doing it. Initially, all my friends and families, they didn't, they thought that it was just my idea, another idea of Air Rise that, you know, he's been talking about this Marathon de Sables for over 10 years. They said, well, yeah, whatever Air Rise, we'll see. You said that 10 years ago, 10 times. So initially it didn't um, sink in with my friends. But as I went on my training and social pictures and videos on social media, now they understand that I am going and they are very supportive. Everybody around me, they are very supportive and they know that the challenge ahead of me. Um, now they understand why I'm doing and they've seen the difference in me physically and mentally, emotionally. They, um, they are 100% behind me, supporting me, which is, you know, um, very good to have that feeling. My training is based on walking. I walk to everywhere. It doesn't matter whether it takes one hour or two hours, I walk everywhere. I don't use public services, uh, transport services just doesn't work for me. And um, I do average between 80 to 100 kilometers a week. And I have done um, a long stage walk uh, last summer in Turkey. I did 44 kilometers in seven hours, um, about 35, 40 degrees in Turkey's heat, and I felt okay. And overall, in last 13 months, I have walked 2,500 kilometers in an all. This is my training. I train, you know, normally 20 hours. Then the weekends, long days, 35, 40 kilometers. I never slept in a sleeping bag. I never camped in my life. I am looking forward to that experience myself. This is, is all unknown for me. And this is what I'm going there. And this is going to change my life forever. That's for sure. Either way, but I am going to finish that crossing line, definitely. I want to raise £10,000 for homeless children. I know that there is thousands and thousands of children out there that are homeless and they are working in the streets every day and have no place to sleep or have no family to go or there is no one to love them or show emotion and effect. Even if I can help one child, change that child forever, that I will be very happy man in my life. And unfortunately in Turkey, there are thousands of thousands of thousands of children out on the street. I just, I've started this, hopefully I can achieve uh, what I can, what I set to achieve but um, I'm not going to stop here. Marathon de Sables will be my first challenge to raise money and following years, following uh, races, I'll find other events and I will carry on. I will dedicate my life uh, to help homeless kids. <music>